All right, here we go with episode 694. Let's go ahead and get straight into it. You know where we are, and you know where we're going. Three, two, one. Diaper bombs. I don't know that I'm ever going to get over the diaper bombs. Long nosed goblin man, huh? <laughs> I see. I still think he has the best power. You can make shit, man. Anything you can imagine, you can make. That's pretty damn awesome. Yep. <laughs> yeah, thank you for the arrow. That helps. It's like those... Stupid YouTube thumbnails where they got the arrow pointed at something. Morons. Yes, yes. Gee. Sneak right past them. Nobody looks up. <laughs> I like the little fluttering uh, wing sounds. <laughs> You know, HIG made a point that I hadn't really thought about. The geography has changed since uh, what um, Pika did, right? He just, he's actually changed the geography of the of the island. I hadn't really thought about it like that, but it's absolutely true. <laughs> yes, join my crew. Be my right-hand pirate. <laughs> All your dreams come true. <laughs> Dumbass. He can't even succeed in his dreams. <laughs> he don't even know who the hell you are. Yep. I mean, he probably would make friends with you this fast, but this didn't happen, so. <laughs> you're going to crash straight in the mountain. That's why you're not watching where you're going. Don't ask. <laughs> Don't ask. She's deep in the crevices of the palace. The the black cells, I think they called them in Game of Thrones. <laughs> Way back there. He's been there? Oh, the naughty room. So I guess if you're naughty, you know? I mean, it makes sense, right? Ah, shit. Now we got Leo crying. Look, I am the prize, man. You need to focus. Oh, I see. You still need to focus. <laughs> Guess he knows a lot about it, right? Too late. Where's uh, Anna when we need it? Of course, back, that was Elsa's decision to stay in her room. This one's not her decision. 
<laughs> they come visit her. It's a big room. I wonder what's in it. This looks like there's some boxes. They didn't feed her? Jesus, man. Damn. Yeah. Well, I guess she was bad, right? So. Oh. So they framed her. Okay, I see you. Or she's lying. Both things are equally possible. Yeah. <laughs> what? Wait, you brought me food to eat some of it with me? That's not very nice. Yeah, she seemed pretty good, man. She looks just like her daughter. What kind of person brings you food and eats part of it? When you're in a situation where you can't get more, right? You you were naughty yourself. I'm sure you were. Put a shirt on. Any cost. <laughs> Their only problem is they're a little loud, the way they locomote, right? Those, those wings are pretty loud. Man, these toy soldiers got wrecked. Shouldn't have been talking shit. Limbs all over the place. <laughs> that horse still looks pissed. <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh, damn. God damn, man. That wasn't very nice. Well, this is to explain why they can't ride the horse anymore. Jesus, he killed him? Holy shit, man. What is this, Attack on Titan? Damn, that was random as hell, man. Horse murdering bastards? You got to take him apart. Yeah, yeah, he's he actually cares about something besides himself now. That's right, off with his head. F that guy. Get him out of here. Oh shit. I see. So we gotta atomize you. Okay. Duly noted. Can't put yourself back together if you're in 1,500 parts. No, that's a different show. Yeah. Quit seeing shit. It's weird. Damn. Yeah. So we're just punishing people now. This whole episode has been people getting punished. <laughs> Not really into torture porn. Can we move on? Damn, dude. <laughs> oh, shit. Are they going to revert back to toys, or does she have to touch them again? I'm assuming she has to touch them again. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. Boy, that's not good. <sighs> if Luffy gets turned into a toy, we're all screwed. <laughs> Maybe she's traumatized. Maybe she won't want to go out. <laughs> She's scared of long noses. Yeah, the PTSD. Stay your ass inside. Yeah. Immediately going full vampire. 
<laughs> yes, they look like noses. We get it. <laughs> you need to eat more than grapes, man. Oh, shit. That's where they come from. Gotcha. Yeah. <laughs> She's furious. <laughs> nice transition. That's a very nice transition. Oh, shit, man. It's my shooter in the face. We know she's older than what she looks, right? So, shooter in the face. You didn't realize it, though. Right, that's what I'm saying. Right. That sucks. That really sucks. She needs to die. Look, I don't typically say that, right? She's got to go. Bring the net down. Is anybody going to do anything about this net? Now we're talking. Shoot her in the face. In the face. He's going to use his special uh, flower binoculars, right? <laughs> oh. That might work. That might work. One shot. One shot. All right. We can do this. Right. Doesn't mean anything can reach her right now. She can be behind three walls, right? But at least she'll know where she is. Yeah, poor dead bird. He got an idea. What could the dude draw to help him? Um, drone? Do like a drone strike or something? <laughs> Shit. Don't even think about it. Because he has a very authoritative uh, voice, man. Who wouldn't obey him? That's how, oh, man. You know, you know how strong you'd have to be to pull four guys, four grown ass men towards you. That's eight, nine hundred pounds you just pulled towards you, and you threw it back like it was nothing. That dude is ripped, man. Meanwhile, she's a goddamn problem. Yeah. <laughs> Shit. Well, this don't give her much control if she turns into something she can't even see. Okay, now she can see. Come on down. You're the next contestant on The Price is Right. <laughs> uh, nothing like that. <laughs> this dude's nuts, man. Nuts. Oh, the two old men. Yes. Take each other out. We never have to worry about the stupid G again. Shit bag, huh? Yeah. I figured the the G and bag would would get him excited, yes. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, y'all want to back up. This is not going to be pretty. <laughs> no.
This ain't even full blown, man. From either one of them, I suspect. That's just, uh, we're just feeling each other out a little bit. Which is not as sexy as it sounds. Shit. Anti-aircraft fire coming in. Oh, God damn it. They got their shenanigans music going. <laughs> Shit. <sighs> this is worse than anti-aircraft fire. This is like that drone strike I was talking about. Damn it. Yep, he's dead as hell. The bugs are definitely dead, which means you're dead. Now, he should be able to the pop, pop power. Huh? He should be able to form a... Uh, he can do it. She can, of course. Maybe she can go into herself and appear on the ground with momentum lost, right? But um, the other guy could form a barrier... With this power, which I think would it'd be enough air resistance to slow him down. You see what I'm saying? That's right. Get his ass. The rest of us are out of here. <laughs> Just go. <laughs> yeah, I'm assuming his sh shield would actually hold up the uh, air. Allow enough air resistance for him to slow down and not die. That's That's what I would try. I don't know if it would. It could, it could, the air could be passed through it for all we know, right? But it's worth a shot, right? That's right. Top them. Have we seen him do that before? Maybe once. Of course, he's used to be people, so if you kill him, that's not good. Here they come. Like I said... They need to be at least 27 pieces each. Because they have to use arms that are attached to the torso to put the head back on. If the arms are separated from the torso, the legs are separated from the torso, and the head separated from the torso, there's no, nothing, the arms don't have leverage to put anything back together, right? You need a friend to do that for you. So, take off their head and all their limbs. Here it comes. Here's the key. <laughs> We're close. Dumbass. <laughs> oh, I thought she was... Uh, I thought she would like go into herself and come back out on the ground, right? But she can do wings, so it's good. Yeah. <laughs> You're supposed to be... Uh, she, she's going up there. Shit. God damn it. She had just fallen here, man. Shit. <sighs> if, this is where you need wireless communication with each other. Damn, not a tramp. Huh. You're about to get your ass whipped. Her dad will definitely kick your ass. Nobody cares what your name is. You're not going to be around long enough. You're goddamn right. Yep. Somebody's got to get up there and get to Rebecca. Yeah, no, she's right. You got to go. Where do you guys think you're going? Yeah, I love the looks on her faces, man. Very menacing. <laughs> Where the hell do you think you're going? Yeah. <laughs> Kind of feels like you're dragging out the end of the episode, yeah. 
you had to you had to burn an extra couple of minutes. <laughs> I was like, why is it taking so long for him to get his last line before the cliffhanger? Well, they had to burn a few minutes. Well, you know, 20, 30 seconds. Feels like we're getting closer. Like, once Law gets his cuffs off, I feel like that's a pivotal point in the story arc. Because then he'll be able to rock and roll. There's a lot he can do. But I love the plot twist that the people who fell are the ones who get rejoined with the group. If only you'd had the key with you, you get you, know, you Rebecca kept going because you thought they were up there. That's actually really cool. I love that. It's a very frustrating misunderstanding, but it makes total sense, and, and it, you know that's how you drag out the plot in a very organic way because that feels like that totally makes sense. Uh, 